What's up, gang? This is Brian with Flint Hill Catfishing out on the Catawba and uh, doing a little uh, river adventure today. Just headed down to uh, a takeout that's about six miles, eight miles down the river and just gonna have a good time. So stick with me. We might catch some fish and uh, maybe we won't. I don't know, but we're gonna have a good time. So stick around. Big Daddy Gizzard Shad. There he is, y'all. We're getting ready to cut him up. Gonna cut him up, baby. Pulled up in the spot here. Anchor down. We're gonna see if we can get something to latch onto that. All right, first bait in the water. Now we wait. Just got a good takedown on this rod on the right. Let's see if he comes back. There he is. He's biting it. Uh, fish on. See what he looked like here in a minute. All right, first fish on of the day. He wanted that body piece, I guess. Flathead. And a flathead. Pretty decent, probably about seven, eight pounds. Maybe more. I ain't caught one that big in a while in here. Folks, Mr. Flatty. Hadn't caught a flathead in a while. He's pretty good. He's not not huge, maybe seven, eight pounds, maybe something like that. It's pretty good fish. I'd like to catch a big one like this out of Catawba. Anyway, he had a slow bite like a flathead. I figured that was the case. So let's let him go. He's ready. <laughs> Gave me a big screw you on the way out with that splash, I guess. That was awesome. I'll take that, buddy. Got my bait back, too, so that's good. The wind's blowing me everywhere, man, because of this. Uh, it's just blowing all over the place, and I'm trying a new anchor trolley, but I'm dropping everything here. I'm trying a new anchor trolley, but. It's uh, taking me a little getting used to here.
Head on down the river a little bit. I love this new kayak, man. A lot of room, super comfortable. We spend a lot of time in this this summer. And spring, and winter. I'm currently just, uh, just looking at the sonar, trying to find a couple holes here in between the rapids. It's really shallow right here, but. Got him, baby. Yes, sir. Oh, he come off. Felt like a good fish, too, man. All right, we're gonna pull up on this island up here. Take a break for a little bit. Hold up. Damn it, man. Hold up. So just drifting, heading down the river a little bit and got a uh, a couple baits off the sides just to suspend it underneath the boat. I'm in about 16 foot of water right now. Not a lot on the sonar, but I'm probably drifting about three quarters of a mile an hour, something like that. Something hooked up here. Took my GoPro off, but he's taking some drag, boy. That's a blue, I think. Or a flathead, I can't tell. Dang, on, he's taking drag, boy. He ain't like it too much, I can tell you that. Peeling drag. A big fish, man. A strong one. Craziness. Man, it's a good fish here. I was about to go to sleep, y'all. This joker's throwing down now. Y'all, this is a good fish. 
I wish I'd have my GoPro on. Ah. He's a big one. Look at that. First, first larger fish in the kayak. That's it, That's it baby, Catawba River. He's healthy now. Let's see what he weighs real quick. Then I'm gonna get him back in the drink. I don't know if I can do this one sitting down. I'm gonna have to. Dang. Hang on now. You gotta turn it on first. Yeah, he's about, about 28 and a half, somewhere in there. He felt like he was 50 in the kayak. <laughs> Got this one down on the Catawba. Hey now. First good fish on the in the kayak. I'm gonna let him go. Put him back in the drink. Oh. He's a chunker. There he goes. That's good stuff right there. Woo! Now I'm slimed up. Well guys, that's a wrap for today, man. We're gonna call it. Hit it on in. Got a couple nice fish today. That last one was a real treat at 28 pounds. It was kind of fun, and that was the biggest one I've caught in the kayak so far. So anyway, thanks for tuning in. This is Brian with Flint Hill Catfishing, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.